Hello you guys, it is Monday, December 3rd right now, day four of Vlogmas. There are 22 days until Christmas, which is so exciting, and I am gonna just vlog for you today. Yesterday's video was a holiday makeup tutorial. Um, this morning I've just been painting my nails, or I do gel, I have a video up on my channel if you wanted to see that, um, and I've just been doing that. It's like 11, what time is it right now? It is 11.04 right now. Wow, it's so much darker over here. So I need to pre-film like seven videos this week because I wanna try and get all of my videos filmed for when we're gone Um and so yeah, anyway, next week is the last week we'll be in South Carolina for December and then we go home to Michigan. So I'm trying to get everything filmed this week and then next week I can just crank out a bunch of editing and then vlog for you guys and stuff because four days a week I'm vlogging and three days a week I'm doing beauty videos. So um, yeah, that's what I'm doing right now. I think I'm gonna order some stuff from Walmart to do Walmart haul uh, later on this week once it gets here because I think they have like two day shipping. Um, and so I'm gonna order our stuff online because I found Walmart has a lot better stuff online than they do in my store. Like they'll have some stuff, but not everything. Um, and then what else do I have to do today? Oh, I need to go to Target because I wanna get that Revlon one step volume styler thing. It's basically like a hair dryer and a blowout tool in one so I've always loved the look of blowouts but I never can do them with like a brush and a hair dryer so I'm hoping I like this because I know a lot of people do and also I think my mom would be obsessed with it so I want to get it test it out and then let her use it when I'm home for Christmas and maybe even just gift it to her. So anyway, I wanna show you Luna. I'm gonna stop rambling right now. I need to get myself put together. I'll probably show you guys what I do for kind of an everyday makeup. So here's Luna Bug. Here's Luna Bug. Oh, aren't you the sweetest? Yeah, aren't you the sweetest? Sweet girl, she's so sleepy. I love her little spotted belly and her little tattoo. You're so cute. If you're new here, Luna is my doggie, obviously, and she is a Basenji mix. Um, Basenji is like an African hunting dog. We had never heard of it until we adopted her from a shelter, so she's a mix. Um, and she is a little over a year old. She turned a year old in August. So, well, that's her estimated birthday, at least. So, that's a little puppy poo. Oh my gosh, oh, and big news too. My sister got engaged this past weekend. Like, we knew it was coming. Like, we knew for a very long time that it was coming. But she got engaged, and it was its so exciting. I'm obviously in South Carolina, so I haven't seen her since it happened. But once I go home for Christmas, like, we're going to celebrate and stuff. Probably go dress shopping, which I can't even believe. Like, oh, my God. <laughs> so I'm so happy for her. Like, so freaking happy. But so that happened this past weekend. That was really exciting. So anyway, okay, I need to go put myself together. Once I start doing my makeup, I'll turn you guys back on. <laughs> It's a little crazy with the lighting, but we're gonna have to deal with it. So, I'm in front of my window, just sitting down. Sometimes I do it in my bathroom, sometimes I do it in front of the window, but here we go. So I'm gonna do my CC cream from It Cosmetics. I'm just gonna do a pump of that. And, should I use this? Yeah. And I just like to use my fingers sometimes with this because it's just easy. Cover up some zits with the Photo Focus uh, Concealer from Wet n Wild. And then I'm also gonna put a little bit of this on the under eyes. Wow, this is the worst lighting in the world, but can't really help it right now. Okay, I'm gonna use my Flower Beauty Concealer under the eyes and on the nose and chin, just a little bit there. Take my e.l.f. Ultimate Blending Brush and just blend everything together. So I just go in with this brush and blend everything. And then I also like to take it down the neck. So I have a um, like self-tanner on, 
but it's gotten all weird on my neck like this is one of the first times it's really gotten strange on my neck i think it was because i put on maybe put a little bit too much lotion on my neck or something um but it really like came off weird so i just go over with the sponge then my CoverGirl Vitalist Healthy Powder. That's my favorite. I'm just going to go over the whole face with this. That's a little bit better. I still have a little bit of lines on my face, but it's better. Now I'm going to use this Wet n Wild Bronzer. Just a little bit on the face. I don't want to go overboard with the bronzer today. Just light application so as you can see i've had a few more breakouts recently trying to keep them under control i'm still taking balance um but most of these breakouts aren't like cystic they are little ones from like clogged pores i'm almost positive so i'm just trying to keep under wraps like what i'm using um and I don't know, try not irritate my skin and clog my pores. I don't wear makeup every day. I didn't wear makeup yesterday. So like, don't be like, oh, you wear too much makeup. I, I understand that makeup can cause it and stuff, but whatever. So I'm just using this bronzer on my eyelids to do kind of an eyeshadow hack. I do that every day. It's so easy, so quick. I'm using this Wet n Wild contour brush. And then I'm using this Physicians Formula Butter Blush in Vintage Rouge. And going on my cheekbones here. Sometimes I skip the bronzer and I just do this blush because it's like a very, very, very neutral brush blush. And it kind of um, doubles as a bronzer. So I like to use that as well sometimes if I'm in a pinch. And then I'm using the Milani um, Day Glow 02 Strobe Light Highlight. I don't know. It's in the shade Day Glow. And this Wet n Wild brush. Just going to highlight the cheekbones real quick. And the nose. Eyebrow area. I really need to pluck my eyebrows and trim them. Again, this is like my quick everyday makeup. I can do this in 10 minutes easily. Um, don't think that this needs to take a long time. I'm probably just taking a little bit longer since talking to you. I guess it's I've only been recording for like seven minutes, eight minutes. All I have left after this is if I want to wear lipstick or not and then my mascara. I love Aquaphor. It's the best thing ever. Their healing ointment for your lips so I'm gonna put a little bit of that on it's gonna look weird right now because I have foundation on my lips and everything but I'll wipe it off when I want to do lipstick some days I wear lipstick well most days I wear lipstick I just really like it but if I'm in a pinch and I want something super quick I just don't wear it and I just put aquaphor on and wipe off obviously the foundation on my lips so that um they're not so pale and they actually have some color to them so I'm just curling my lashes. I think I'm going to skip um, mascara primer today. I'm just not feeling it. I just want to be really, really quick. So if I can find my mascara, that's what I'm going to do next. There it is. It was out of the bag. <laughs> I'm using the Volume Stylus 18 Hour Lash Extension Mascara from Essence. And curling your lashes is what is going to make a huge huge difference I mean the primer definitely helps with volume and everything but curling them is what really really helps I think all right I really need to empty this memory card because it is basically full there's Luna girl she joined us all right I kind of forgot about this stuff this is the pixie makeup fixing mist but I've been using it or I used it again the other day and I really remembered how much I love it so yes Oh, it feels so good. Oh, no. I'm an idiot. My mascara wasn't dry. Ah! Gonna have to fix that after this dries. Okay, so I just took off that Aquaphor. See how, like, my lips, my natural lips have a pretty good pigment to them? Jeez Louise. Okay. I'm gonna put on my favorite lip liner. This is Caramel Nude by CoverGirl. I... I have a full video of all my favorite lip products if you're ever curious it's probably one of those that i'm wearing 
and I almost always have caramel nude on. Ta-da, okay. Now, I'm gonna put on Champagne, which is from CoverGirl as well. This is their Exhibitionist lipsticks. Another ultimate favorite of mine. And I think I'm going to just leave my hair in this bun, but kind of fix it up a little bit and get changed. And then I'm gonna go to Target. Isn't she like the cutest thing you've ever seen in the world? Love her. All right, so I'm back from Target. They did have the Revlon, um, what is this called? I always forget. Like, One Step Hair Dryer and Volumizer. They had this at Target. Um, it was sold out there for a little while after Black Friday and everything, but they finally had it. They had two in stock. Thank God I almost didn't see it, but I saw it. And then I got a few other things. I got Batiste. I haven't had Batiste dry shampoo in forever. I've just been using cornstarch, but this is obviously a lot more convenient and easy to use. So I got that. I got the hydrating micellar water from CeraVe because I've been using this almost like a toner. Um, and then sometimes in the morning, if I'm too lazy to like wash my face, I just use this. Um, and then I got some deodorant because I needed some. And then I got this because uh, I didn't want to go somewhere else for uh, spray paint. And I want to spray paint those little houses. Um, where is one? Let me show you. These little houses that I showed in my like Christmas decor haul. Um, these are from Walmart. They were $1.92 and they, I'm going to spray paint them white. So I got this. It was a little bit more expensive, I feel like, than normal spray paint, but it wasn't too bad. It was like $5.99 and I'll use this for other things. It's just a white satin um, spray paint. So that's what I got from Target. And now I'll probably go wash my hair so I can go try this out. I am going to do a video on it, but I want to like try it before the video so like I know how to use it and kind of have a review of it instead of just a first impressions. Okay, so I just washed my hair and used that tool and sneak peek. I like it a lot. So anyway, now I have fresh hair. And I'm happy about it. And I need to go throw in laundry because it's like 2 p.m. And I got to go get Caleb around like 5.30. And it takes a while, you know. So I got to do that. And I'm hungry. I don't really know what to eat in our house. Maybe I'll have like grilled cheese and tomato soup. I don't know. I kind of want to go get something. But we've also eaten out quite a bit lately. So I'm going to like <sighs> struggles. Anyway, okay. I'm going to go do laundry. Fun. Hi. Hello again. Just a little update. It is 3.23 and I just got done doing some work for my part-time job. I don't know if like you guys know this, but I work remotely for a visitors bureau up in Michigan. Um, so I just did some work for that and then I need to get to editing this <laughs> for tomorrow and then my Wednesday video and stuff too. Oh, I put a coat of um, spray paint on those little houses and I'm gonna go do another coat because the spray paint I got said you can wait like five minutes, which that's pretty nuts. And I didn't do like a heavy coat because I knew I would need to do a few. So anyway, let me go show you guys what I look like. Look at, look at how cute this dog is. I like cannot, cannot stand it. I can't stand your cuteness. I can't stand your cuteness and that sleepy face. Mm. Oh, you're so sweet. Look at that sleepy Dobby. We call her Dobby sometimes when her ears are back like this. She looks like Dobby from Harry Potter to us. So we always call her that. She's a little stinky girl. Mm. She's so good and always sleeps while I work. Except for not the best for Caleb when he comes home because she is usually insane by that time but i'm like i'm working too which i am so whatever it's turning out really nice sorry the air conditioners are on out there from someone but let's do this i'm the biggest idiot in the world i just ruined my nails Come on, focus. Look at that. Oh, I don't know what to do. Now I'm gonna have to like put another coat on them or something. Gosh dang it. I knew I should have worn gloves, but I was too lazy to go grab them. But the houses are gonna look really cute, but like, oh, look at this. I'm an idiot. Okay. <laughs> Screw that. Let's try and scrub these and see if it comes off. Woo! 
Woo! Mission accomplished. I got the spray paint off. Can you see? Hello? Can you see? Got the spray paint off. I just scrubbed them with soap and water and it came off. Luckily, I think it was brand new enough that the top coat was really resili resilient and I washed my hands right after I was done. So, okay. Mission, no. Uh, lesson learned, do not use spray paint without gloves when you have a fresh manicure. Yeah, okay. I just had some green tea and I kinda wanna make another one. It's so good. I made it iced and oh, so delicious. I'm liking this vlogging because then I like can talk to people during the day or like think I'm talking to people, you know? Look at this girl. Usually I just talk to her. Usually I just talk to this girl. Oh, there's a baby. Who's the baby, Luna? Look at her eye, her blue eye. It looks kind of creepy right now. <laughs> That's a lie though. I actually talked to Caleb like once or twice a day because he'll go on little walks for breaks um, at work and then I usually talk to my mom and sometimes my sister. So I do talk to people throughout the day. 